Hey guys and welcome back. Okay, sorry for my undone face. I just thought I would do a quick hair tutorial for you guys because we had a power outage yesterday so I didn't get to do anything. Um, so yeah, I wanted to come on and do a hair tutorial because I got my hair cut yesterday. I don't know if anybody remembers but my hair was about down here and I got it cut yesterday and it's like this now and quite frankly I do not really agree with the straight off cutting so yeah I'm just gonna have to try to do something to make it look decent in my eyes hang on I'll cut my hair for you just to show you because it's, it's basically just cut straight off and yeah, she was an old hairdresser, she was cheap, um, so yeah, but I'm going to try to do some I'm curls in my hair to see if that's going to work, because you can see she has done a little bit of a slope here, but it is basically just bang straight off, no um, cutting into it to make it look natural, nothing like that, so I'm guessing she was kind of old school because that was how they cut before. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna attempt to do something with my hair just to see if I can make it look better. And it's quite weird to have this short hair again, but I really had to because my ends were so split and it looked horrible. So, yeah, so it's gonna be interesting. So I've got, hang on, my curling iron on the floor and I'm just going to curl my hair a little bit just to get some some uh, curls into it to see if that's going to fix the straight off looking. I might have to do this a little bit different because I just can't, I can't get it to do the ends as well. Hang on. Yeah. Okay. So, how am I going to attempt this then? Oh, put the iron down without burning the floor. And then dividing this up. Oh, and I have to talk about one thing. Have you ever seen this? This is called Invisible and it is supposed to be um, invisible when you put it in your hair. Like, not invisible, but it doesn't like crease your hair. And I bought it yesterday and I'm really pleased. It's like I don't even have to put it that many times around. Like I do too, and that's enough. It stays there, but you can see it makes this pretty little thing. And I found so far it hasn't made any dents in my hair. So yeah. Um, of course now I can sleep with my hair loose because it's kind of hard to braid this short hair. But it's okay. Okay, attempting again. To do this, oh, maybe I should just do this. Ah, uh, no, Lily, what are you doing? Okay, we're just gonna do this like this. And I'm sorry if I don't look at you guys, I have the big mirror in front of me, and I'm using that to guide me just to see. Okay, leave that alone. Put this one down, hang on. I said leave it alone. <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm a little bit of a mess today. Like, it's kind of, kind of hard to get into the gist of, of making a video today when I was supposed to get one done yesterday. And it annoys me so much. We had like, an hour of power outage. First we had 10 minutes, then it came back, then we had an hour, and then 
Hubby got a message because Power Ouch is in his name. So Hubby got a message from the power company say, Hey, we got it fixed. We rerouted you. But guess what? You can't use that much power because we don't have full capacity. Yeah, duh. Amazing. So it was so unstable all of yesterday evening and it annoyed me because I wanted to do a video but I couldn't at all. So yeah. But I'm doing it today for you guys. Yeah. And it's quite weird to curl short hair, I have to say. I really do have to say. I should just watch Nikki Philippi a little bit more because I think she does short hair. I need one of those heating gloves badly here. Yeah. But I think she has done some. Uh, I think I've seen them. I'm gonna have to look through her channel because she just cut her hair like about the same length that I had to do mine and I think she has done some videos. Do I dare to put this one right there? Yes, I did. Okay, now. And the lady uh, that did my hair, she did something really cool. She braided my hair, like, from all the way up here around. And it was really cool. And it looked so good, braided. I wish I could do braids like that myself, but I can't. So yeah. Nee, 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 nee. And I'm sorry this is taking so long, but you're going to have to live with it. You know how I am. Yes. Um. Yeah. Oh yeah. I wanted to tell you guys about these books that I bought because I was so inspired by Graveyard Girl that I wanted to get the Rectus Journal. I wanted to get it for my mum and my sister for Mother's Day because Mother's Day was Sunday, that part, the part, past Sunday and I wanted to get the, the collection, the four books for myself because I just wanted to try to do it and guess what? First off, everything was ordered on the 23rd of January. Yeah. Then, I got a message, hey, we don't have the box set in storage. How fun. So it's going to take us 5 to 15 days to get it here, but or not to get it here, but to get it off to you. So we're going to wait five days to see if we maybe get it in before we send off the other two books. Well, guess what? The 30th, they sent off my mum and sister's Mother's Day gift. Has it arrived? No. Not at all. And it pisses me off because today is what? 11th, 12th? Hang on. I'm not good with dates, so... It is the 12th today. Yeah, how funny is that? And it said on the note they sent on my email, it said two to three days. What? It's now been 13 days. Oh, and it's like, whatever, get your fingers out of your behinds. Oh, and my book or my books I don't even know when I'm going to get them and I was going to do reg oh now I'm so annoyed that I'm making mistakes I was going to do wreck this journal on my blog and now I can't I can't do anything it's like I'm just gonna have to sit here and wait till they get their fingers out of their behinds and fix it and if it does take too long, I'm just going to message them and say, Hey, I can see you guys are supposed to have all four books in singles. So, guess what? You're going to send me all four books in singles. Because, and then refund me the rest of my money that's left over. 
buying them in singles because you are just annoying me so so much right now and oh yeah I just got a text so let's check out the text uh, uh, hang on just got a text happy because he's going to log out of the kids placing on the baby girl's phone okay so I'm quite annoyed with that and I've told them if it doesn't get fixed really soon I'm just going to give them a down rate I'm just going to go everywhere I'm going to be viral and tell everybody how horrible they are um, they haven't even offered like a compensation for the time today is actually the 15th working day the day when they are supposed to send the book the last day and I haven't heard squat all um, so yeah and that's why I'm actually talking about it today because I haven't heard anything from them I haven't gotten an email that they send it I haven't heard anything and I told them on the 12th I'm just gonna go viral I'm just gonna tell everybody how horrible you are how horrible you treat your customers because no compensation have been talked about no nothing and it's just yeah it pisses me off last time I ordered from them I spent almost 7,000 Norwegian kroners almost 700 pounds in their shop to buy cell phones for me and my hubby and this is what I get come on and I know others that has ordered like TVs that were like um, a lot of more money like I don't know 15,000 or hundred and oh, hang on, one thousand five hundred pounds. And when the TV arrived, it was broken, and the company just said it's the mail's fault. So the mail people treated the the package as it said carefully, so it was broken when it came to the mail office and they didn't want to compensate no nothing <laughs> and it's just yeah I don't know I just don't know that kill didn't want to go my oh well there so I'm kind of annoyed with this whole thing because I really wanted to give my mom and my sister this book for Mother's Day because it is such a special book it challenges you in such an interesting way and I really 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 wanted to give it to, to them and now I can't because of this stupid company I even went into the post office yesterday to turn in one of those missing package um, what's it called well, you, you write on this, um, oh my god, what's it called in English? Okay, I lost the word. I'm sorry. I'm just, yeah, kind of annoyed. But you write down all the, that you know about the package and they send it off to the post company that is in, like, Christensen. Um, or maybe even Oslo but they start searching for your package even though your package isn't searchable because it's um, what's it called it's sent in a letter they didn't even send it with a trace they sent it in a bloody letter oh yeah annoying extremely annoying so yeah so I'm not really pleased with them at all now let's see if I can gather all of these up here and just do that. Well it stays. That's one thing. So I'm just praying that I will get this these books maybe. Ow! 
sorry about myself these books really soon because I really want them for my mum and my sister and I really want them for myself because I want to get started with Wreck This Journal um, so I've been really bummed out and I've not been good at doing my blogging um, at all I, like I put up yesterday about my new shoes and my new shoes is about a week old now so yeah so I have just had like the worst of moods because of this but it's okay I'll survive and on Mother's Day um, I actually got my snowsuit finally got a snowsuit because um, I've been wanting one for a long time because I only have like pants and, and a jacket and the jacket is just too skinny so that I get cold really easily and the thick one is too short because it's like one of those really fluffy um, oh no well it's one of those really puffy jackets that looks like the Michelin man and it is a short kind because it's supposed to be short so when I use it it's like a bit, little bit of time and then uh, it splits so that I have no clothes on in the middle of my stomach and it's freezing so I finally got a snowsuit, a red and black snowsuit that I'm going to use when you go to the mountains in Easter because my mum and dad has rented this big cottage and invited everybody like my sister and her family and us and our family or me and my family to go to the mountains with them and I just can't wait because it's going to be amazing I don't know if I'm going to ski but who knows we'll see and I thought hey I'm going to film some over there so yeah so I'm going to film some for you guys um, I'm probably going to have to be careful because I know my dad isn't really that fan of going online so I'm just going to have to like film when I'm alone or with hubby and baby girl and John but I'm going to get to try to film a little bit at least so yeah My goodness, it is so hard doing it on this side. Oh, craziness. Okay, turning it this way, I think, I hope. Ouch, don't burn yourself. Do, do, do. Okay, that should be enough of that. I'm so terrified of burning myself again because the the small burns I've had so far isn't isn't big. So, but I had a big one. And I'm just terrified. Okay, now how are we going to do? If I do it, no. do it like that that works oh yeah apart from my hand feeling like it's going to break off any time yeah <clears throat> and I'm sorry my voice <clears throat> my voice is a little bit bad these days but yeah we'll survive I sound like I've been drinking whiskey like all night sometimes We'll survive, as I said, we'll survive. Okay, we're just gonna keep on doing it this way because it was just hang on, get back here you stupid end. And I just hope this is going to work to cover up that my hair is cut off straight off. Because if not, I don't know. I'm gonna have to wear it up in a ponytail at all times until it has grown because it is only for a little while. My hair grows like weeds. 
so it's only for like a little while until my hair is back to normal so I can survive having my hair like this for some time in about six months I'll probably have the same length as I had before they cut it um, so yeah I wish I could give everybody that struggles with their hair my my jeans my hair jeans because I have like so thick hair both the hairdressers that was um, at work just had to come check out my hair because I have an undercut and my hair is like still the same thickness oh, me. still the same thickness as anybody's hair that has a false head of hair so they had to come check out my hair and it was quite fun I was like yeah just come touch it I don't care <laughs> so yeah so she came and touched it the other hairdresser as well so yeah it was quite quite fun because my hair is like thicker than my sister's full head of hair and she hates me for it she wants my hair, she wants my jeans, my hair jeans. <laughs> I wish I could give them through her, through her, to her. Be because I kind of don't like having this thick hair. But yeah, it's quite difficult to have this thick hair. At least for the most part, she is. So yeah. Ouch. I need to find a better way of doing this side of my hair because this is quite difficult to do and now for the last part and I really want to get this part pretty so how can I do this? I'm just going to have to oh, oh my lords okay, I'm just going to have to do this uh uh what I'm going to have to do. And it's not Christmas Lily, come on! Why did that song end up in my head right now? Turning it off and now placing it on the floor. Taking this one out. And now let's see, do I look like a sheep? Or do, does it look okay? Kinda do look like a sheep. I hate my hair right now. I'm having it like a really bad hair day. And you can still see that my hair is like soup straight up. But I'm guessing it looks better than just keeping it straight maybe I should just do put it out with all this monstrosity here no I'm just gonna leave it like this because it's hair yeah but you can see she did the size as well so I'm really pleased with that maybe I should just everything to one side that's an idea just pin this one back hmm maybe I should do that take this little part here pin it all the way to the back here Yeah, not so stupid after all, right? Aye, Lily. 
Now just to find something to bring it back with. Because I don't think I have anything here now. Why? Why, why, why? I guess one of those. And I wonder why these are called bobby pins. What's the dude called bobby? And this one keeps bleeding on me. That was another one. Please be normal. Oh, behave. Like that. Okay, I'm just going to leave it like that. I think I'm going to a little bit in the front here. Still looks cut off, but who cares? Do I get? I don't think so. Or do I? Do I need to make me a messy bun instead? Mm, I don't know. But that was my little tutorial today. So I love you guys so much. And I keep doing everything in the wrong order because my head is so messed up because I'm so angry with this company. But I love you guys so, so much. It's a pleasure for me to put out these videos. Um, so yeah, bye. See you soon.